Welcome back, everybody. This is Damian Black here. We are back to uh, watch them give us money and hopefully not be mad at us. Even though we killed everybody this month. Oy. So, oh, you know what I forgot to do again? One of these days. Pow, right in the kisser. Alright, so this one won't matter too much. We're already short on engineers as it is. Starting to think maybe I should have just thrown these in the U.S. That would have given us more money for next time since, I mean... Yeah. Alright, well, we do have the interceptor that's going there. How long until it's there? Two days? Should have done that all at once. We don't have the alloy for that. Um, How long do these take? Ten days? You know what? That will work. We're going to need that. Let's see. Items. Light plasma. Yeah, yeah. I have heavy lasers, that's good. So we will be able to get the three of these. We have 25 engineers, so in 10 days we'll be able to build the workshop. And yeah, we're probably going to build another workshop next month. I'd like to start getting psychics though. I just don't think that's going to happen. I bet you do. Yeah, nothing that we really want to risk there. This, I wish we could. I'm happy that we have these two. That's going to help out a lot. And, yeah, let's get this ball rolling. Interceptor's in. Let's go ahead and load it up before the satellite gets there. We did put that in Asia, yes. I have done that before. What do we got? What do we got? Aliens are leaving us alone this month. Alright, let's just start this process now. Okay, so we have enough engineers, I think. I can get another satellite. And how much time do we have left? 21 days. Back off of that. Still 21 days. Engineering. Let us actually cancel these. Get our money back. And rebuy them. Hopefully. Alright. And let's keep going. Arc thrower for three scientists. Three arc throwers for three scientists. Not now. Who's still hurt? Nobody? Alright. So let's see. We have one, two heavies, two supports, a sniper, and an assault. I can live with that. I may want to do this just in case. One last thing to think about. Can we even build one? No, what are we missing? 20 alloys. We have one alloy. We need a ship, and we need a ship now. We're like three months behind. Alright. So again, I will uh, fix their colors and setups and everything else, and we will be right back. Hey, I just realized something. Outside of... Uh, John Osterman being our sniper, which is ironic. Take a look at this, okay? 32. 0. 1. Now, there's there's three there, right? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Oh. Yeah, I'm having way too much fun with this. I'll be back. All right, we are back. Uh, let's see, let's see. We got Walter Kovac. 
Daniel Dryberg, Laurie, whose name I'm not going to butcher again, Eddie Blake, and John Osterman, all being led by Peter Griffin. That is actually a scary thought. And I've decided to keep him blue just because he is John Osterman. Uh, if you do not understand him, he is the gigantic pink schlong that, uh, yeah, if you ever, we'll get to that point. When he gets a nickname, you'll understand this a little more if you haven't gotten it yet. Let's see, let's see. We have Arc Thrower on Peter Griffin since he uh, has the best dodge and everything else. As long as whatever he can see, he's got an extra 5 defense up to 20, so that'll come in handy. It makes like, if, you, if he's surrounded, it makes him really good. Um, or at least better than the rest of them. I can't say really good. I hate assaults, but it looks like we may be stuck with some. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, he, you've got a nickname. I'll fix that next time. And then when we get back, we'll just take care of it then. Um, <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we should be good to go. Uh, let's go raid an alien ship of unknown size. Oh, that was weird. I haven't seen that happen before. I have circled around and flown and had my ship stuck in Antarctica before. Back when you could send two sky range or two interceptors at things. Epic music playing during this? Oh god, I think the game is glitching. Hopefully uh, we'll be able to get this all patched out and kill all the aliens on here and everything before anything happens. Eagle has landed. Alright, this is a large. I can tell you that now just by the map. Does it look foggy to you guys? It's like the weirdest thing. Like, We noticed one day that there was lightning and we didn't know what to think. No aliens for Peter Griffin. Ironically, Eddie Blake became an assault. I think that that's, uh... I think that's ironic, for lack of a better term. No, I think that that's actually kind of funny. And justified. It is going to be really hard to work with this guy for right now. But we are going to make it work. The rest of them won't be as difficult because you know you can move and shoot with them but snipers are really limited and, and a, a, oh, a weak sniper late game is is the worst all right let's see we're gonna take you up here and reveal all of the aliens that we can nothing I'm gonna take you and do it next I should get it back, but I don't feel like actually doing that today. Glory, who has the best aim of all of these guys, ironically. Because, let's see, yeah, she should have 80. Oh, wait, no, he'll... John will have the best aim. But that's because he's got a scope as well. And let's have Peter come over here. And you can go there. So we are at the front of this ship, by the way. If you haven't figured that out. I'm expecting, as we can hear, the mutons to be right in front of us. Usually they start you off in that corner way back over there. So it's a little different with that, but not too different. Let's see, who do we want to move up to do this? It should be you. I think it's going to have to be Peter, though. And we're going to have to figure out how to do all of this here. And by this, I mean actually the killing portion. John, why don't you move up to that spot? Why don't 
you drop down here. And you know what? You just move to the middle. Losing the headset. Okay, so there's two groups of mutons now. Whoa, that was a left click, not a right click. All right, quick pause. switch you back to that. Alright. Since left click mage move, let's try it again. Nope. Still nothing. That's kind of disturbing. So let's see. Next turn we can move you up there. You don't have any of this and neither do the others. But... There's only so much that we can do. This has got to be terribly boring to watch me inch forward. And I'm not going to apologize for it. I'm just going to state the obvious. Come on down. There we go. Let's see, any place over there that we want to be? No. Alright, now we'll show them. That's right, come on out. Sweet. Who's flanked? Oh. Blah. Well, we'll give you a shot here, Night Owl. Alright, now that he's out in the open... Oh, and you lose your shot. And you only have a shot on that guy. Well, I'll let you take that. Nice shot! Let's see here. Oh, come on, I actually wanted you to hit that. Who's got shots? Just you guys. You know what? Can you do this? Well, you can't kill him, but we may be able to do something. So, we could lose Peter Griffin here, just... Just something to think about. Because that's only going to give him 25. If we're lucky, he'll throw a grenade. You want to come out. Yep. I feel a rocket. Does anybody else feel a rocket? Do not miss this rocket. No, you didn't. You hit that rocket just fine. <laughs> Alright, nobody panicked. That's the good thing. I don't know if you guys know this, but that's how everybody dies. Somebody panics. I'm going to go after this one.
I don't need you to level up. I need you to level up. Five short of the sniper in aim, eh? Alright, so there's the big muton that likes to run around and smashy smashy. That is a berserker, by the way, if you are unaware. Um, they just run around and hit stuff. No, that's literally it. And we're going to retreat a little bit. I want that thing to come out to us. I don't want to have to run to it. And it will. It's not smart enough to stay away. And they're not smart enough to hit it. We're going to have trouble here if nobody wants to hit that thing. Alright, you I actually do want to capture it. So, how are we going to do this? Why don't you take your shot first? Alright, good man. Eddie Blake, where you at? Right there. You don't have a shot. Alright, Laurie. Can you do this? Way to play ball. Alright. Oh, oh, oh. Do not... Well, you panicking is actually okay. Just... Alright. Sniper... All right, John, let's see what you got. Can you do this? Not one. We may not be able to capture this one just because we may have to actually kill it. Let's see now, if I run and gun you over here, so that leaves you and you. Can you hit this with two damage? Just one. Alright, so we have a chance. The question is, do we want to take that chance? If we miss with our chance, he dies. Let's see what your chance will be over here. Wow. Two seventy percent. One of them has to hit. All right, that one hit. Good, good. We're okay. Yep, and that muton's over there. But he's got the wiggles. I need him to get some more hits. Or kills. Alright, first up, let's go see that thing. Is it there yet? No? Okay. And we have to move forward. So, how are we going to do this? Um... I'm going to put everybody back to their randomized locations that weren't so random. Switch you back over. We need to, to do a muton autopsy here soon. We're going to start needing the, uh, the information from them. Yeah, all right. Reliable Peter Griffin from Canada. Can you just sit there and do nothing? Because that'd be awesome. Sniper. John. 
Your job. All right. So that's all of the aliens in the area. Let's see, you can run up all the way over there next turn. So we've killed off, let's see, five mutons and a berserker. If we don't show anything, you will do your thing, but since we're going to pretty much be staying where we are, well, within reason, I'm going to actually move you out into a no cover area. All right. I'll move you up as well. Again, the most important thing right now is to actually level our sniper. And that's just so that it can be our sniper can be somewhat remotely useful. Let's see. So you can go all the way up there. Could this be the ship responsible for the attacks taking place during the alien abductions? This should be, let's see. First month is Sectoids Thin Man. And we get light plasma rifles, heavy plasma rifles. Uh, armored guys, heavy floaters, and then sectopods, and whatchamacallits, uh, muton elites. So we have one more month before that. The battleship should arrive the month after that. I want to be able to take down the battleship. You'll understand why when we get there. Our blue man is still doing his thing. You hear that? Yeah, it's not what I'm looking forward to. Um, hmm, how do we want to do this? I was going to reload you. I still will. Uh, out of the fear that something's right over there, I guess we have to. I can't afford to, to risk showing mutons in there right now. I need to actually be ready for them. So we're going to curve over a little bit. And you are on guard duty. With the weakest gun that we have out here. So all I'm hearing is mutons, which actually makes me feel pretty good about this. Um, if all that there are, are mutons left, then that means that I can come over to this side. And I'm, ex I'm suspecting that they're in here just from how the sounds are going, which I'm mm, not as thrilled about, but I mean, I can deal with that. Let's see. So I got Peter Griffin and Daniel Dryberg over here. And I'll stick the other three over here. Let's go ahead and take a look. I figure the two assaults have the ability to run and gun, so that should help out. Um, nothing shown by there. We're not going to see. If it if it doesn't see you when you first walk in that room, it's not going to see you before you leave. So, yeah. We're going to go up to go around. And they'll see John well before anything. Arg. We were going up to go around. I think we're just going to have to do something here. 
All right, so they're staying inside. Cool. I can live with them staying inside. I can't live with that, John. Uh, let's see. What do we want to do here? Don't show anything. Don't show anything. Good job. Yeah, Leroy Jenkins in this piece. You guys saw that. You know what? Throwing a grenade over there and just doing the five damage was an option, and I didn't even think about it. Alright, so we got one flanked. You do not have a grenade. What do you have, I wonder? I am going to take this shot. Who else has a grenade? You have a grenade. That's not pretty pretty. You have a 35 on your shot there. Now if I do this, he's going to throw a grenade at us, but it looks like we can take it, so... Reliable. You see, I got two different ways that I can point her. Alright, we'll do it that way. One there, and the other one there. And even though I know you're going to throw a grenade at me, I'm going to take away your shot. Just don't throw another one. Alright. Let's see, let's see. So, options here. Wow, I was going to say, like, Peter Griffin, or, uh, Eddie Blake should be able to throw that there. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. No, 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 no. You are not supposed to freak out. Calm down. <sighs> yep. That's the big one. The one that has a life. Good job, John. Alright, John got his promotion. We can't get close enough to capture that thing. Lori, kill it. Alright. I'm not expecting any more enemies. I am going to reload on the move here. Well, was going to. Got one. Last enemies I'm expecting are the uh, guys in the tank. Oh, man. I guess towards the end you did start to panic a little. Realize that you were getting beaten. Tossed out of a window. Although, it was still kind of funny. So I guess you got your wish. I'm ready. 
And let's see, Walter Kovac, who you should not have panicked. I'm let down by your panic. Luckily, you still, uh, about as good as you were. Reliable, that's about all I can say. Let's see, so why don't you go there? Luckily, we bought those three other people. Ah, endangered servitude. The XCOM Project's truth. Ready to rock. We're buying people for $15. Whole human beings. Aye, aye. On Overwatch. Got it covered. Yay. Alright, so I'm expecting two of them. If there's a third, I'll be surprised, but two is two seems good. Let's see, so we're going to heal Blake. And the reason we're going to heal Blake is five should be able to take a shot from one of those plasma pistols. Let's, uh... I don't want to risk actually opening that door. Let's see, that's for you. That's for you. That's for you. Okay. So, everybody should be able to take... Oh, crap. That actually scared the crap out of me, just for simple fact that I was not expecting that. Um, adjustment. Huh. How are we going to adjust for this? I think we still kill these guys, and then follow through. Because, I mean, if they show up coming through here, they're going to die. Yeah, stop roaring. I don't think there's any question now. Two of them. Hey, I'd like to be able to see. I don't know what's going on, but the game has been doing that lately. Uh, we need to move you out of the way, though. That will be the kill. And I'm having Peter do this. I know I should be like spreading the, the levels. But right now, there's a bunch of mutons behind us, and I don't need to deal with death. So, Lori. How are we going to do this? That looks like it's about the best place that we can get to for this. Walter Kovac. And... You know You two should really just hang out together. So let's see. Who puts their money on up top? Instead of out of this door. There we go. Move you a little closer. I'm going to set you over there. And you, my dear, can come right there. All right, so they are outside. It's just a matter of where. Hey, right click is supposed to click people. Oh, I'm sorry, left click.
Sometimes it makes you wonder your lefts from your rights. He's actually the guy I wanted to reload too, isn't he? Yep. All right, one more round. Hi, we're aliens, and we haven't noticed that anybody on our team is dead. So, whenever you're ready, come kill us. All right, so it's three of them. Let's see, you have a bad shot there. One ran over here, one ran over there. None of us can take a shot from a heavy plasma rifle. I think I want to just blow that thing up. Through the wall! I don't know if you guys notice the super teleportation skills, being able to throw something over here and have it pop through the door, but that was awesome. This is one of my least favorite things about this game right here. Alright, so there's a guy right down there. Come on. I hate when the game gets stupid. Let's see, if he comes over and up this way... Right here should be good enough to protect us from him. That should stop them from seeing him down below. That should have flanked him. It did, it's just not showing. Oh god, I need you to hit that when it happens. Luckily we have another one of these. Alright. Step one complete. Survive. Let's see here. If I drop you down like that, that should give us something to do. Andy's in heavy cover. You cannot get up top any which way. Mm. I think I'll have you peel back around. Why don't you come join her? Wow, he went far away. What's that simple phrase? Nope, nope. That's not going down like that. You want to have that happen? Uh, it's still bad with you, too. Hey, look at that. Don't miss. Through the ship! Ladies and gentlemen, we have the world's greatest team. Alright. Oh wait, I said I wouldn't do that. Alright, so that's fixed. Still need this to happen. One shot. Girl, we're going to have you go right there. And why don't you smoke him? Smoke's in the air. That's not specialty smoke. Why is it that color? Oh. 
Uh, looks like he may be going around front. If I have you come sit right there, I can reload you. And he shouldn't be able to see you. You can go over there. John, John, John. John, why don't you go there? Who's this? Eddie? Uh, you guys aren't going to be able to take that thing on your own. Uh, you should be able to help them. But I kind of want you over here. That is like the worst place in the world. All right. Uh, looks like he may be coming back. Coming back. Good hit. Look at you, Kovac. And we got him flanked. Nah, it's just raining his death. Alright, you take this hit. Oh, can't take the hit, can you? Alright, girly. You make the kill then. And a promotion. Another successful, Another successful operation. Couple hits, couple dings here and there, but I mean, it, it's getting the job done for the most part. We're uh, trekking along and getting things accomplished. I have no idea what I said I was going to do for episode lengths, but I have not started the timer, so this one's gone long, and I don't really feel like editing, so yeah. The uh, pauses when I paused it were about the best you're going to get for editing, and somebody still needs to figure out what, what at least a pilot looks like. I mean, does the ship fly itself? Right. So he's got some defense. I'm going to have him start carrying the arc thrower, and it's just because... Uh, He's a little bit less valuable. Uh, you're still going to be carrying med kits, and you, sir, welcome to the real sniper club. Six kills. Not bad, John. Not bad. Uh, we're missing three people, max of four days. We got the berserker. We're changing our research because this berserker interrogation will cut down the uh, time on that Titan armor in half. So, yeah. Let's see. Titan armor in two. You know. Yeah, it's just not worth it. Uh, facilities. What we can do now. Oh, we still can't build it? What the hell? Oh, $200. Bleh. Like, what are we missing? Well, there's 20. I only need seven of these unless I have researched it already. I thought that it was $150 for that. My apologies. So, Scilab, go. Once that's up, it'll make it a lot easier to deal with a lot of things. It'll give us a wider range of, 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 a, of defense and attack. There we go. A wider range of tools to use. Let's see here. So, we spent all of our money. Ships are all ready. Uh, we have four satellites coming in, which should go one, two, if we go three, that cuts off two countries, and then whichever one of these ends up in the red, we can toss a satellite there. Yeah. Alright, so let's go and get the Psy armor, or the Titan armor. Sweet. And we will cut it after I pick a new thing to research. Um, we could do that. We could. Or I could get him a real gun. 
We might have to start looking into this. I think for right now we'll do this one. I'm being quiet for you. Megalith arm, go. And he just bats it away. Like, what type of material do they have there? Because it's not a normal glass. Alright, either way. This is uh, Damien Blackgear signing off. Everybody, I hope you've had fun. We'll continue this. We will win. We're going to try not to lose a country. And we will see you again soon. Bye-bye.